Albion face Arsenal at the Emirates in a game that is simply too tough to call. Whilst the Gunners are without a win in eight matches in all competitions, their longest winless streak since February 1992, the Seagulls haven't won away from home since the opening day and have never won an away game against Arsenal. Will interim manager Freddie Jungberg triumph in his first home game in charge or can Graham Potter conjure a much-needed win on the road? It'll be Moy. Moy, lovely turn. In it goes, flick to the back post, more pace there! Oh, just, just out of reach of Aaron Connolly and past the post. Agonising from an Albion perspective. Ball across was flicked on, Morpé. Don't know whether he was crossing or shooting, but that was close from the Albion. Zaka being urged to shoot. Torreira might do so. He makes space for the shot. Is he fouled? Lacazette, Aubameyang, it bundles past the post. He didn't catch it as he would have wanted to, but Torreira wants it pulled back for a free kick. Graham Scott, I think, making the point that he allowed the advantage to be played. Probably tripped himself as well, Torreira. And then Aubameyang going for that far corner. Neither side at their fluid best, but here's Proper, who's fouled by Lacazette. Albion want to get on with it, and they do, and they're allowed to. And Morpé strikes it, Leno with a smart stop down to his left. Albion just thinking quicker than Arsenal here. So easy. Into Morpé, and he got his shot away. Albion's best of the evening. Real fizz in that drive. Stevens into Moy. Moy tries to get his shot off, and that will be a corner. Gross with the kick. Burn. Connolly on the turn. It's rifled in. Alpin have a deserved lead, and it's Adam Webster. His second of the season. Oh, they've deserved that. And Adam Webster gleefully smacks it into the back of the net. And Albion lead with 10 minutes or so left of the first half. Woeful defending from Arsenal. Lovely from the Albion. And Adam Webster's face says it all. Pure joy. Good ball. Aubameyang dinks it across, really good ball, what a stop by Matty Ryan. He's applauding Steven Alzate, but Matty Ryan deserves all the plaudits here. Excellent work from Aubameyang, teasing Burns, standing up the cross, there was the header, and actually Alzate does deserve credit. Pepe on to Bayerin. Burn with a strong challenge, it loops up and out for an Arsenal corner. In from Ozil, flicked on by Lacazette, and it's gone in. Arsenal a level reward for the bright start they've made to the second half. Not even sure who scored it. Good corner, Lacazette with the header. Don't think there's an offside. And it's looped in with players falling into the goal. Davy Proper desperately trying to get there. Did Kolasinac get a touch? Ryan certainly did. I think it's going to stand. And Albion's hard work in the first half has been erased in five second half minutes. Frustration for Ryan. And Albion once more trying to cut through the heart of the Arsenal defence. It's Morpé. Alzate, the option on the right. Alzate stands it up to the back post. Moyes there. Morpé must score. What a save from Leno. It really should be 2 1 to the Albion. But instead, Albion just have a corner. Brilliant goalkeeping from the German. The Alzate cross was inch perfect. Moy leapt at it. Morpé. 
just couldn't sort his feet out. Luis looks long. And Arsenal have a free kick here. Dan Byrne, eyes completely on the ball. It is a foul, it has to be said. He's totally accidentally has caught Pepe, and it looks painful. In it goes, Luis is there, 2-1. Albion trying to play a high line, and Arsenal taking advantage. And it will be offside. That will not stand if VAR is doing its job. A clear offside. And there's the cheers from the Albion fans confirming the offside. Here's Leandro Trossard. Pascal Gross, the man to make way. Trossard has proven impact off the bench. He has. Just a shade over 10 minutes to do something here and claim a famous three points for the Albion. He's immediately on the ball and immediately threading a pass through for Moy. And Moy, in it goes, Morpé! Oh, yes! Albion restore their lead through Neil Morpé. Seconds after Trossard comes onto the field, threads it to Moy, across it goes, and Morpé's header could not have been more precise. Albion lead 2-1 at the Emirates with 10 to go. Is that a wry smile from Graham Potter? There's a big smile on the face of Neil Morpé. Understandably, Moy across, Morpé's head are perfect. Just guided into the corner. That is precision, no chance, Leno. And he runs over to Aaron Moy and the Albion fans to celebrate. Could this be their first three points away from home since the opening day? Arms outstretched from Potter. Xhaka, Tierney to his left, here he is. Alzate sold himself a little. Decent cross, there's the header, and Ryan pushes it away. Excellent stop. There's been a collision here. Duncan Alzate, I think. Excellent save by Ryan. It's a good header. Ryan scrambling and athletically tipping it away. But now Trossard. Given away by Xhaka, Trossard up against Luiz, Trossard stepping over it once, twice, picking his way through, Trossard over the bar, oh, it would have sealed it, with a flourish as well. Lots of fizz in the left-footed shot, not sure Leno would have saved it, shake of the head from Trossard, he knows he was inches away from sealing the three points. And there's the final whistle. Albion's away day blues are over. A landmark win for the Seagulls at beleaguered Arsenal. Their winless run continues. Credit to them for stepping up at the start of the second half to level matters, but Albion slowly but surely took control of the game again in the second half, and Neil Morpay's header has given Albion all three points at the Emirates and there is more to come from this young side and it's the Albion fans in the corner of the Emirates who are singing loud and proud. It ends here in North London, Arsenal 1, Brighton and Hove Albion 2.